Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel Code for Kids. So today we are going to learn about machine learning project which is like a how we can classify the images. Okay. Suppose if I have three image like I have tiger image, elephant image and any boy image. Okay. So with the help of our training to the machine now we will classify who is striker, who is elephant, and who is boy? Okay, so let's start our project. So you have to open your machine learning for the kids. Now we will just click on try it now. Over here, we need to create project. So project name, we can write anything. Suppose I want to write image classification. Okay. Then recognition type. Recognition type means what? Suppose we can put any text. We can put any images, numbers or sounds. It means like for your machine, which type of data you will provide. Okay. So for my machine, I want to provide the images. Now you need to just click on the create button. Okay. After that, we have to just click on this image classification. Over here, we will get three things. So first, we need to train our model. Train in the sense, we have to give the training. Okay. Suppose if we want to create any machine. So for that machine, first, we need to give the training. Okay. So for that, we will click on the train. After that, over here, we need to just click on add new label. So I want to add three label. First one is my what is my first label? Tiger. My second label is elephant. And my third label is I want to add boy. Okay. So now see we have a three label here. Tiger, elephant and boy. After that now we will provide some images here. So now how we will provide the image. So for providing the image, we have to open one another Chrome, okay? Or any web browser. Suppose I want to give minimization here. And you can first increase this, okay? Like. So here we have a three label. I will minimize this one also. like this now so as you can see now we have a two tab okay so what we have to do now first we will search for tiger we have to add some images which is related to our tiger okay so how we will do that here we will search for tiger press the enter button you will get lots of images. So suppose this is the tiger. So we have to just drag and drop that. After that, we have this image as a tiger. So we have to add at least seven to eight images. Okay. This one is also a tiger image. After that, see, this is my fourth image. Tiger, Tiger, so Tiger. So you can add any number of images here. So we did for Tiger. Now we have to search for Elephant. So now uh, you have to just drag and drop the Elephant image here. One, two, three, four. Scroll down, you will get more images. 5, 6, 7, 8. You can give any number of images. Okay, 9. Now, I want to provide the image for the boy. So, we can search boy. Press the enter button. You will get some images. So, we can put all these images here. Third, uh, wait. Third, 
scroll down you will get more images suppose this one is the fourth one fifth sixth seventh even if you are boy you can add your images also or what girl can do they can add the label as a girl okay and you can add your images after that see we added the image about tiger elephant and boy now we have to back to our project. Now what is our second step? We have to test this model because see we created, we trained our model. Now what is our next step? We need to test this model, okay? So see what we did now. We collected eight examples of tiger, nine examples of elephant and nine examples of boy, okay? Now we need to just click on train new machine learning model. After that, we have to again back to our project and then we will click on make. Make in the sense, we have to develop this project now, okay? So, in this step, it will take around one or two seconds, okay? See? So, this model is available. We created this model, right? Now, again, we need to just back to our project. We have to click on make. So once you will click on make, you will get three options here. So this project you want to open in Python or App Inventor of Scratch 3. So we will, we want to open this in a Scratch 3. And you need to just click on open in Scratch 3. After that, we have to first delete this cat. Okay. Then we want to draw some backdrop. So what you can do, if you will take your mouse here, you will get choose a backdrop, then paint option, or even you can upload any backdrop. For our case, we want to paint this backdrop. Okay. Now, what design you want? Suppose I want to draw one rectangle here. So you have to just drag and drop like this perfect so i want to take another color you can take your favorite color okay now we can draw one more rectangle here that's perfect now i want to draw one more here so after that, we have to take one another color now. This is my third color. Now, we can draw one more here. So, you have to just drag and drop like this. So, see, now we have three colors. Right? Now, we have to just write, take your text. So, where is the text? This T symbol. Here, I want to write tiger. We can change the color also. After that, we can take this here. Second one is elephant, okay? So we can just take the position wherever you want, you can add that. And what is the third one? Boy. So we can add boy like here. So say we did our design part, right? Now we have to do, we have to add some sprite. So we can select choose a sprite, okay? So over here, so let's see whether we have an elephant or not. See, we have. So you can just take one elephant. After that, in this elephant, we need to add some costumes. So choose a costume. Here, we have to search for tiger. So we don't have the tiger, okay? So we have to download the tiger. Now we will search for boy. Okay. So now what you can do. You can first download the tiger image. And boy image. So 
go to the images quickly download one or two image so i want to download this one save image as save perfect save uh, we want to download for boy so suppose i want to download this perfect now we have to again come back to our project just go back so here we have to click on upload okay so this is our upload costume button click on that you have to just go to your download option so from here select all files so you will get boy we have a boy now we can just minimize the size of the boy. Suppose 40, that's perfect. Upload costume over here. We want to select our next costume, which is Tiger. That's great now. Wait. So see this file type is not supporting here, okay? So what we have to do, we need to again search for the tiger and we have to download the JPG file, okay? Suppose save images, you have to check. See, this is the JPG file, that's perfect. Again, we have to upload costume. Oh, this is not a JPG. So we see, you will get. So after that, we have to start the coding part. So how we will start the coding part when flag is clicked. So always we have to start from the event. When flag is clicked, so basically we want to go to one position, which is our middle position. Suppose I want to go to here. So what is minus 220? So we can write minus 2 and here minus 20. Okay. After that, we have to repeat this. So we need to just go to the control. Take a repeat. Over here, we have to just take condition. So we have to recognize 3 images so we have to take three conditions like we have tiger elephant and boy so we need to take three condition if over here we have to just classify like a which is that image okay so if your image is tiger so where you have to go just go to your machine learning over here we will take if this recognize image okay means if this recognize image instead of image we need to take our costume image okay if this image is instead of 50 we need to take tiger okay so we have to just duplicate this You can duplicate the entire thing so we can add that here and again we can duplicate you have to just click on this screen duplicate you can add that here okay so if instead of tiger you have to take elephant and boy remove this tiger from here we need to take a boy okay so if our costume image is tiger, so we have to go to this position. What is this position? So you need to just go to the motion. And here we have to go to this position. Same if that is elephant. So we have to go to that block. And we need to take this here. So 
you will get that position okay after that we need to broadcast one message okay so where we will get that broadcast inside our event we have this broadcast so we will broadcast one message because see every time we have to take a different costume right so for that we will broadcast this after that once we will receive that message we have to just take our next costume so we need to just go to the backdrop we will take next costume okay now see if i will run So now, see. So this is the tiger. That's why you will get a tiger position. See, okay. So how we will do for the elephant? That is our second question. Like a, how we will do for the elephant? So every time we have to show this. Okay. So we need to take show here also. We have to take show. Show means we want to show our block, right? See, if I will run, you will get tiger. So here we broadcast that message. So now we have to receive this message. When I receive message one, so we want to change the costume. See? Now, if we want, we can take a weight. Because see, uh, we can take a weight. For one second. After one second. Or else you can take your weight inside your if condition. See, it is recognizing perfectly, right? Good. So, in this way, we can classify our images. So thank you so much for watching this video. Please like, share and subscribe our channel and press the bell icon if you want more latest update. So thank you so much.